Hello everyone. In an earlier video, we took up this constrained minimization problem and used the Lagrangian multiplier method to solve it. This is the manual solution that we had set up. And just below, if I drag down, you will see the solution using matrix algebra. We are going to use Excel now to arrive at this solution. For doing this, we have first of all set up the coefficient matrix. This is the coefficient matrix, which I have written here, matrix C. In this space here, we want to find out C inverse because our solution is C inverse times this vector of 0, 0 and 10, which we called the K vector before. First of all, let us select the region where we want the inverse of C to go. It is going to be a 3 by 3 space. We do that and we type in our function M inverse and we select the array. After that we hit control shift and enter all at the same time. This is C inverse as you can see this is the same matrix as we have here. This is the C inverse. We also have a K vector which is this vector here 0 0 and 10. This is that vector. All we need to do is to multiply C inverse with K. So we select the region where the multiplication result is supposed to go. It is going to be a column vector, a 3 by 1 vector. We select the region and we type in our function mmult. C inverse is going to be our first array. So we select that, comma, and the k vector is going to be our second array. We select that, close brackets, and hit control, shift, and enter all at the same time. And there we have it. This 5 is the value for x. The next 5 is the value for y. And minus 10 is the value for lambda. So we have successfully minimized the objective function subject to this constraint of x plus y is equal to 10. This is all I wanted to show you in this video. See you later.